q equals b plus 1 over b minus 1. We are asked to make p the subject formula. Now, to begin with, you can do cross multiplication or you can also use LCM, but cross multiplication will work faster here. Because when you cross multiply, you're going to have q equals p minus 1 equals p plus 1. All right. Now, let's simplify. I'm going to have QP minus Q equals P plus 1. Remember, we asked to make the P the subject formula. All right. So, to begin with, you collect like terms. The one that have P in common will come together. And to do that, this P will cross over the positive sign. I change negative P. And this minus Q will cross over. I change to positive Q. So, you're going to have QP minus P equals 1 plus q now when you factorize qp minus p i'm going to have p in bracket q minus one equals one plus q and to make p the solid formula by both side by q minus one q minus one therefore our p this will cancel this will be one plus q over q minus one All right now looking at this to make it look organized. Though this expression is correct, but to make it look organized, position the letter in the same direction and position the number in the same direction. So this is the same thing as Q plus one over Q minus one. It's now looking more organized. The Q is at one side and the number term is as one side face each other. That will be the answer to this question.